So I just want to say, like, we are living in such amazing times. And I know a lot of people watching are just looking to rape, kill, and destroy if they're still stuck on that stuff or if they're not surrendering their hearts to Christ. You know, Jesus said, when you see these things coming to pass, look up, your redemption draws nigh. Okay? I mean, that, you know, the Bible never fails to show how deep the scriptures are when we see them coming to pass. It's really amazing. The Revelation 12 sign, wow, I mean, just gone in a week. You know, we should probably be appreciating this stuff. Um, could something happen in the next couple days? Yeah, probably. We don't know. You know, the knowledge of the stars is something that is lost to us in our time right now. In my studies, I learned that when Abraham was searching for God, he searched through God by looking at the stars. And God first spoke to Abraham when he was staring at the stars. And that's a prophecy of how Abraham's seed was going to be as innumerable as the stars in the sand of the sea. But they had the knowledge of the stars back then. It's lost to us now, but we're in such a rare opportunity that we're seeing it come to pass. I mean, we're just learning. I'm just learning. I don't know. I want to learn this stuff. I think it's really incredible and amazing. You know... Every single one of us, every single, every single soul has a star up there. And God's decree for that person's life is written in the sky. The gospel is written in the sky. I know it's true, but it's lost to us now. And we have a rare opportunity to begin to possibly get a glimpse into that knowledge. So, you know, look up. Our redemption draws nigh, guys. Surrender your heart to Christ, please. Put away the warring contention. Let it go. Thank you for tuning in.